Welcome back to Nippert Stadium for another construction and expansion update here on GoBearCats.com. Tom Glitter, happy to chat with project manager Bob Martin as lots is going on. This project getting larger and larger by the minute, day after day. We continue to see it grow, but Bob, let's forget about construction for a minute. If you have an opportunity to, to be in the South Lounge area, which is about 20 yards in front of us, the view from there on game day is going to be spectacular. Uh, yeah, I was looking for my cold beer. It's not there yet, but it'll get here soon, I think. So it is a spectacular spot. Since the last time we were here, this area has been filled in with concrete and steel just keeps going closer and closer to the sky. We're uh, pouring concrete today. Actually, it's done. We started at four in the morning to stay clear of the, the students and traffic and whatnot. And so they're uh, finishing that concrete off now on their uh, on their 360 degree riding lawnmowers, as you call it, and uh, doing a nice job up there on 400. So once that sets, uh, sets up, gets a little cure on it, then we'll get those big uh, famous A-frames with the A-team back up in the air and, and our last lift of, of steel to get up to the roof. What's interesting is that the 400 level filled in with concrete, as you said, beginning at 4 a.m. today, we see the 300 level or the 300 and then the mezzanine or the patio suites. That's where there will be some concrete actually filled in after the 400 is done. Right. Uh, tomorrow, uh, our forecast is not quite as good, so fortunately we were able to get the 400 level off today. Tomorrow, uh, forecast of rain, so they're going to come down to the mezzanine level and get that concrete poured and semi out of the weather, but it's a, it's a good place to be. When we see the structure come together, didn't see it quite as much three weeks ago, but today we can see the full outline of what those patio suites area will be where the people have not quite the full suite, not the club suite, somewhere in between. That's going to be a sweet little area as well. I mean, they're going to have some some primo spots and seats in that, and in a, 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 a really unique angle to the field as well. So uh, every seat's uh, a great seat in this spot. Now on the other side of the stadium, it's all fenced off. Traffic has been rerouted. Everybody getting used to their new pass to school or work or wherever you may be headed. And they're starting to do a little exploring over there, and then slowly but surely the the construction and I guess destruction will begin. Uh, officially in the decommissioning mode down there and uh, we're finding out where all the hot wires are making them uh, making them not hot anymore <laughs> and, and discontinue disconnecting all the utility lines and uh, making sure everything's out of the way so that we could bring in the ram hose and start bringing it down in another I would say another couple of weeks yep. and and you you hinted at it but the next group of steel that'll be going up is the 500 level that is the top level of the structure Right, it's the A-frames going from four all the way up to the roof, so it covers level four, five, and then the roof, and that is the last lift. Right. All right, well, next time we are out here, three weeks from now, we hope to get up onto that 400 level. That's where most of the suites will be. We certainly look forward to it and appreciate the time as always. Yeah, my pleasure. Go Bearcats. All right, and that is Bob Martin. I am Tom Glitter here at Nippert Stadium where lots of exciting things still going on. Make sure you stay tuned for all the latest here on Bearcats TV.